Exercise 6a, question number 1. We want to find the midpoint of. Uh, so, this is the formula I am going to use x1 plus x2 divided by 2y1. So, 4 plus 6 midpoint. Four plus six divided by two comma two plus eight are the y values divided by this is going to be five and five. and b Midpoint is zero plus twelve divided by two and twelve plus two divided by two. This is going to be six and this is going to be uh, Sorry, this is 6 plus 2. 8 divided by 2 is 4. C midpoint equal 2 plus minus 4 over 2 and 2 plus 6 over 2. This is going to be 2 minus 4 in minus 2 over 2 and 8 over 2 this is minus 1 and 4 rd um, minus 6 plus 6 divided by 2 and uh, 4 plus minus 4 divide by 2 so this is 0 divided by 2 and this is 0 divided by 2 it means 0 0 part e midpoint is 7 plus minus 3 2 x values divide by 2 and 2 y values minus 4 plus 6 divided by 2 so this is going to be 7 minus 3 4 divided by 2 this is going to be 2 divided by 2 it means 2 1 is the midpoint if midpoint is minus 5 plus minus 11 make sure when you write negative uh, you have to put the bracket even I don't mind you are putting a bracket here even it is more safer than doing mistakes uh, minus 5 plus 8 divided by 2 so this is going to be minus 16 divided by 2 and uh, this is going to be 3 divided by 2 it means minus 8 and 3 divided by 2 one point j midpoint 6a plus 2a divided by 2 4a plus minus 4b divided by 2 so 8a divided by 2 and 0 divided by 2 and uh, 4a uh, 0 is the midpoint and the h midpoint 
minus 4u plus 3u divided by 2 and 0 plus minus 2v divided by 2. So the point is going to be, this is going to be minus u divided by 2 and this is going to be minus v midpoint a plus b plus 3a minus b divided by 2 comma 2a minus b plus um, minus b divided by 2. So this is going to be a plus b plus 3a minus b divided by 2. This is 2a minus b minus b divided by 2. This is b to b cancel out. Uh, 3a divided by 2 and this is 2a minus 2b divided by 2. Uh, 2a minus 2b divided by 2 means when you take 2 out, a minus b divided by 2, 2 to 2 cancel out, answer is a minus b. So 3a over 2, a minus b. You have to keep like this. Uh, J midpoint 4 square root 2 plus 2 square root 2 divided by 2. 1 plus 7 uh, divided by 2. This is going to be 6 square root 2 divided by 2 and 8 divided by 2. This is going to be 3 um, square root 2 and 4. Plus, uh, this is k, 2 minus square root 3 plus 3 square root uh, 2. 3 square root 2 plus uh, square root 3 divided by 2 and uh, 3 square root 2 y value plus 4 square root 3 plus minus square root 2 plus 2 square root 3 divided by 2. We can see this is cancel out. This is 4 square root 2 over 2, which is 2 square root 2. And this is 3 square root 2 minus square root 2, 3a minus a, 2a. Likewise, 2 square root 2, then square root 3, this is going to be 6, 4 and 2, 6 square root 3 over 2, which is square root 2 plus 3 square root 3. From here, if you are not sure, you can take 2 out, then square root 2 plus 3 square root 3 divided by 2. Now you can cancel out and you will get the answer. 6a2, that is line segment AB. This is minus 2 file and this is AB. Uh, and midpoint is three four three 
m is 43 now we will write the equation two unknowns a and b two unknowns we need two equation now we will write a midpoint in terms of those two so how do you do minus 2 plus a divided by 2 that is the x value and y value is 5 plus b divided by 2 now you will see that this is also midpoint this is also the same midpoint hence 4 should be equal to this one and this one should be equal to this so we make two equations so hence minus 2 plus a divided by 2 is 4 in minus 2 plus a equals multiply 8 a equal 8 plus 2 10 so this is 10 and uh, this is 5 plus b 5 plus b divided by 2 equal 3 so 5 plus b equal cross multiply 6 b equal 6 minus by 1 so this is 10 1 you can write like this this one 4 3 equal minus 2 plus a 2 5 plus b 2 and then you can work out this is minus 2 question number 3 p and q diameter p is minus 4 6 q is 7 8 question asks find the coordinate of the center of the circle we know that when we find the midpoint that midpoint is coincide with the center because this is a diameter so, center of the circle is minus 4 plus 7 divided by 2 and 6 plus 8 divided by 2 so this is 3 divided by 2 and this is 7 question number 4 r is a diameter so the same center is here now find the center of the circle it means we need to find the midpoint as a usual center of the circle x value of 4a over 5 plus 2a over 5 comma y value minus 3b over 4 plus 5b over 4 then this is going to be 4a plus 2a uh, 6 7 uh, a over 5 and 5b minus 2b over 4 uh, 2b over 4 5 minus 3 2 it means this is cancel out b over 2 question number 4 yeah um, so I miss I have to divide this 2 by uh, 2 so add this one divide by 2 in that case um, this is also going to divide by 2 and 4 plus 2 is 6 uh, b divided by 2 is 2 divided by 2 so we'll work out 6 a over 5 uh, divide by 2 I can write 2 over 1 6 a over 5 multiply by 1 over 2 this is cancel out this is 3 a over 5 so the center 3 a over 5 x value 
and uh, y value b divided by 2 divided 2 over 1 b divided by 2 multiplied by 1 over 2 b over 4 hence the final answer is uh, 3a over 5 and b over 4 Question number 5. AB is a diameter of a circle. So A is minus 3 minus 4, minus 3 minus 4, and B is 16. The first question is find the coordinate of the center of the circle. Then uh, if I take x bar, y bar, then x bar is uh, minus 3 plus 6 divided by 2 and y bar is minus 4 plus 10 divided by 2 equal this is uh, uh, 3 over 2 and this is going to be 6 over 2 is 3 it means this point is 3 3 3 over 2, 3. Part B. Show the center of the circle lies on y equal 2x. If 3 over 2, 3 lies on y equal 2x then 3 over 2 3 should satisfy y equal 2x we have to show this one now so this is the lhs side lhs side is y what is the y value 3 straight up rhs of this equal right hand side equal 2x which is 2 times x is x value is 3 over 2 what is the answer 3 hence lhs equal rhs left hand side hence uh, 3 2 3 point lies on y equal to x line.